Are you on iOS 12 and want to install iOS 13 public beta? Then watch this step by step tutorial. Hello friends, firstly you want to back up your iPhone to iTunes so that if anything goes wrong you will not lose your data. It is very important. Now you want to launch Safari on your iPhone and head over to beta.apple.com. Links down in the description below. Now scroll down and look for this sign up button. Now sign in using your Apple ID and password. Now here is the Apple's guide to install iOS 13 public beta. You need to make sure you select iOS option here and then you can read the complete article if you want. Once you do that, hit this enroll your devices option on the top of the page. Now you want to scroll down and hit this download profile button. Select allow and then it says you have your profile downloaded in settings app on your iPhone. So close this pop up and head over to settings. Tap this profile downloaded and hit install on the top right corner. Enter your six digit iPhone lock screen passcode. Read this message from Apple and hit install and confirm install. Now hit restart. This will restart your iPhone. Wait until it reboots. Now unlock your iPhone. Head over to settings again, select general and software update. And you should see iOS 13 public beta is available to install. Hit download and install. Enter six digit iPhone lock screen passcode and it should start downloading iOS 13 public beta software. It will take time based on your internet speed. So you need to wait until it finishes. Once it is finished, you should see this pop up. Now it will start installing iOS 13 public beta on your iPhone. So it's gonna take some time. Make sure your iPhone is connected to a power source and let this process be completed. Once it boots up, swipe up, enter iPhone passcode and start setting up iOS 13. First hit continue. Now hit agree. Then hit continue again. Select dark mode if you want and hit continue. Now swipe up to get started. And there you go. iOS 13 public beta is installed on your iPhone. You don't lose any data in the process. It is very smooth process designed by Apple. If you have any questions, ask me down in the comments below and stay tuned for iOS 13 features. I am Vikas signing off for the day. Thank you so much for watching.